Ready? I guess. But isn't your mom gonna freak? She's probably cooking with the radio on. She won't hear a thing. I bet she'll notice a hole in the floor. Trust in science, Max. Even when science means blowing shit up. That wasn't the coolest thing you've ever seen! What the heck? Why was the mute on? Anyway, hello everyone. <laughs> Maze of here. Um, occasionally my stream deck doesn't actually seem to connect properly on all the scenes and sources. And that's really annoying. But hello, welcome to the stream. We're going to be playing the uh, prequel to the prequel. Farewell. Hopefully it's not as feels trippy as the last one because I don't think I can handle two days of feels trip. Anyways, I'm glad I noticed that the uh, it was mute problem is uh, within the first <laughs> seven minutes of stream. Uh, okay, that was amazing. That was truly amazing. Why are explosions so awesome? That's like asking why are puppies cute? Some things just are. I kind of wish... I'm, I'm not sure your mom would see... I don't know if they way. actually tried to make them look similar. When she asked me to get rid of my old junk, she never specified how. But I guess I better do some actual cleaning, too. Like, you can kind of see it maybe around Kyle, the eyes. Excavating the closet. Or maybe I'm just see anything seeing else that to myself. Cash, help a girl out and chuck it on the pile over there. Hi, doggo. All right, so this is, I believe, is just a self-contained uh, episode, and I hope it's just it like happy. I spent half my life hanging out in this room. Just Max and uh, probably because I have Chloe, right? I can't believe those days are all over now. So is this? Well, Chloe said get rid of her stuff. In a few days. There's that plant. <laughs> Okay, that was gonna say this was be, must be no when she moves to Seattle. I, see Chloe again. I think that's the original this actress. Could be my last chance to say goodbye. But this is Chloe's room. Your best friend that you're leaving her. Oh, I haven't even told her yet. That's messed up. And I leave in like three days. Is that what I just said? Jeez, man. That's rough. Nah, I love that shirt. I want that shirt. I better help Chloe with her cleaning. And I really do want that shirt. What are you doing over there, Doom Doom? Long last walk around this place. You wanna come on up here? Come on. There you go. Hello, Jesus. I got your butt. That's a good joke. Cool. Alright, so we're gonna look around. Comic strip. Chloe's had this hung up on her wall forever. Neither of us can figure out what happened to the last panel. <laughs> I hope Dr. Kloenstein's okay. Dr. Kloenstein. The adventurous adventures of Supermax and Dr. Kloenstein. Our crime fighting has really soared since you created those rocket boosters. Of course, the power of flight does tend to make things easier. Dr. Kloenstein? <laughs> They're funny. Chloe's always preferred imaginary animals to real ones. Well, besides... Bongo, of course. Who's Bongo? Chloe's mom wanted us to go through this pile of old clothes and find stuff to donate. Instead, we played dress up for an hour. Mm. Hey, Doggo. I got a concert tickets. <gasps> this was our first unsupervised concert together. It was so much fun. We were supposed to see another show next month, but... How sick was that show? How'd you know I was looking at it? The sickest. The sickest. I've been working on my moves for the next one. Check it out. <laughs> <laughs> I know. How about you? 
Any new moves? Totally. Yeah, totally. I've been working on my air guitar. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, Caulfield. Save something for when it counts. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> All right. Back to the junk mines. The junk mines. All right. Got a board game. Chloe and I haven't played Oopsies. this game in forever. And I'm pretty sure it's missing pieces. So does that get trashed? What are you doing? Adding this to the pile. No freaking way. Just because I beat your ass every time we play doesn't make it trash. You beat me? <laughs> That's BS. The last time we played, I wiped the floor with you. Poor Max. Losing your memory at such a young age. I love their banter. Guess we'll have to play again soon and find out. Let's play now. Hell yeah, let's do it. We're gonna get in trouble for not doing what mom said. Oh, never mind. I thought we were playing. Blue, or I thought I said gloomy Let bear. Glowy this bear. Box of trash be a sacrifice to you, <laughs> oh almighty glowy bear. Oh, what's this? Live fast, die young, and go out with a bang. <laughs> Rest in pieces, doll. Can I water the plant? I'm surprised she's had that plant for so long. I don't know what this is, but I don't want to trash everything I find. How about these boy band trading cards? Oh, yeah. Super trash that. Yeah, and hilarious. Remember when we gave them all makeovers? Sharpie boob jobs. Funny back then. Sharpie boob jobs. You mean when you drew boobs on all of them? I was so mad at you. And yet, our friendship lived on. So too will these cards. She's a pack rat. She doesn't want to get rid of anything. Boy band trading cards. That's neat. Chloe keeps trying to get me to hop on her board. I'd rather take pictures. Chloe's such a nerd. She hangs on to all her old textbooks and school supplies. She actually liked school at one point, huh? As usual, Chloe's grades are better than mine. Yep. I still kick her butt in PE, though. That was, uh... Chloe made reference of that in... Earlier in the game, that she could get the straight A's if she wanted to. Alright, we're not gonna lie down. Because I feel like that's gonna do a cutscene thing. What's in here? The Menagerie of Magic. I don't want to trash this that. That sounds seems awesome. like a good candidate. Oh, I should be looking at these first. Dang it. That's my entire magic collection. Do you know how many weeks of allowance this cost? You never use it. You haven't touched these since the fifth grade talent show. Maybe because my assistant turned out to be squeamish at the sight of fake blood. At least eh. you didn't saw me in half. How are you planning to clean this place if you won't throw away anything? A magician never reveals her secrets. Put it back. <laughs> Put it back. Man, she's had a lot of this stuff okay. in the. Whenever I'm ready, her room for I can a long go time. tell Chloe I'm done arguing about trash with her. Here's my camera. Hey, no, it's a dad's, dad's camera. What's your camera doing in here? Dad said I could bring it up here for you to use. He's tired of watching you drool all over yourself every time he uses it. Mm. His words. Your dad is the best. Sure. Just don't ever tell him that. We need to keep him on his toes. I like how long hair <laughs> You're off to a great start. down people's backs. And this game kind of looks like clay. Actually, uh, it's kind of cool. I want your shirt, Max. I bet Chloe's parents were freaking out when she got this letter. Congratulations, your child Chloe Price has been accepted for September 2008 admission to Blackwell Academy. We have offered places to approximately 100 students out of 1,200 applications. Your child ex excelled in all criteria for admission. 
An open house for admitted students and parents will be held on March 26. April 2nd is the deadline to inform us on your intentions regarding admission. Your admission reply form is included. For those who require pen financial aid, please contact Blackwell's Office of Financial Assistance. We look forward to welcoming you and Chloe, the Blackwell Academy family. Marco Gonzalez. That's... I guess he's director of admissions, but I thought it would have been um, Principal Wells. I still Wells. can't believe you're a Blackwell Academy student. How is it? Oh, the classes are incredible. The teachers are actually smart. And the lab is legit. Petri dishes for days. What about the students? Are they as stuck up as you thought they'd be? They're fine. Chloe, you are terrible at hiding your feelings. Is everything okay? I don't know, I just, I like hanging out with normal people. Like you. Thanks, I guess. You know what I mean, I, I hate fake people. You're real. Thanks. People say a lot of things about the Prescott family, but this is pretty cool. I didn't even get a chance to read it. I love I the shark. I think Chloe used to call this guy Mr. Sharky. I doubt she. No, we're not trashing anymore. that. He's my favorite. That was awesome. Who else but Chloe could turn cleaning her room into a pyrotechnical adventure? Oh, yeah, the bed is what was over there. Ooh. Chloe's been beating me for a while, but that growth spurt could come any day now. Uh. We bought this as a gag years ago. I honestly can't believe Chloe still has it. The jawbreaker? What about this half eaten jawbreaker? Serious bio. Years ago? I think my brother actually did that once. No matter how long it took. Don't be a quitter. Ew. Ew. Our illustrious champion returns. Yuri, my dude. Home. How's it going, my man? Welcome to the street. Apparently we just found a, a year old or years old jawbreaker in her drawer. And uh, that's gross. My brother did that growing up once. I was like, dude, you gotta throw that out. Things nasty. Toss it. That's gross. Your mom and your dentist will thank me. <laughs> so lame. Just so lame. Eh. Uh, have to direct traffic. No problem. That jawbreaker is gnarly. Chloe's had this hoodie for years. It's her favorite. I don't think she'd need to throw it away. It's the one thing she's throwing away. What are you doing? Your favorite hoodie. You must have thrown it in by mistake, right? No. It's, it's, it's fine. It's filled with holes and falling apart. Yeah, that's that kind of messed up. That never stopped you from wearing it before. It's fine. Really. Hmm. That's interesting. That's interesting. All right, so let's go late. Oh, that's we saw that. Oh, yeah, out for a minute. Oh, here comes the yawns. This this is probably just a cinematic panning stuff again. That poster in the it's back with so the hard glowing ring kind of looks like room, a, a transistor house, poster. This town. All in the past now. Soon to be. Who even am I without Chloe? She's the one who's always starting things, pulling us into adventures. I can't imagine life without her. Maybe I haven't told her I'm leaving yet because I still can't believe it's real myself. Busting out some of the somber music again. 
is actually putting me to sleep. I could totally fall asleep to this. Dude, that's very calming. Holy crap, I totally could fall asleep to this. Is it just on an infinite loop? I'm gonna get this song and put it to <laughs> just play it on my phone tonight. Put in some earbuds and just pass out. Holy crap, I need to turn it off. I'm gonna pass. It's gonna put me to sleep. Excuse me. Crap, I forgot to fill my water bottle. All right, Chloe, uh, I have bad news, hon. That's it. I'm calling off the search. If you want more trash, you'll have to find it yourself. Yeah, we're not throwing out Sharky. Well, it wasn't exactly the purge mom was hoping for, but at least we tried, right? Right. And now we've got the whole day ahead of us. What do two under-supervised friends with clean rooms and clean slates want to get into today? I guess now would be a good time to tell Chloe I'm leaving. Or I could let us enjoy the day first and tell her later. Oh, it's gonna make me... <sighs> I have to tell her now. I should have told her weeks ago. I have, I have to tell her now. Actually... You might ruin the day. Chloe, I, I have to tell you now. really have to tell you something. It's... Uh, I... Don't know how Holy to... shit! Max, hold that thought. She may she already know. That when I was digging around in here. Do you have any idea what this is? Pirate related. Whatever it is... It looks like it came out of our pirate phase. Your powers of deduction are as strong as ever. This tape is from five years ago. It's a message from our past selves to our current selves. So we were eight years old? That's crazy. I can't even imagine what we sounded like. Did I just push her, or did Rachel just push her over? That's a project. 